hey what's up you guys this is cali curls welcome back to my channel in this video i'm showing you guys a room tour of my boys room mickey and max so if you're interested stay tuned i will be giving you guys all the details of the furniture purchased and some recent items and um, just to make their room look more like a kid's room so first things first i had a lot of questions about their bunk beds so all the information will be attached down below but this bunk bed was from amazon around 300 dollars. i spent days looking doing researching bunk beds especially for toddlers especially for max because max is one and a half years old not quite two i was very concerned especially buying a bunk bed and for him he's a little wild so this bunk bed doesn't come high i believe it's under 50 inches tall and the it comes with the top and bunk bed the top bunk bed i have like a six inch mattress the bottom one i have a 10 inch thick memory foam mattress from mickey's previous bed that i didn't want to throw away because it's a really nice mattress and, it, and it's xl twin mattress and ended up fitting in that bed now this is the play carpet that i also got on amazon i believe it was like 25 bucks and this just has like a little roads and stuff a little boyish so the boys can play with their cars and stuff they love it now I got this from Amazon as well, the Ninja Turtle shelf toy storage. This, the boys really love this. I, Mickey was able to put this together in less than 20 minutes, you know, of course with my supervision. And then over here, you know, I do wanna make this area different, this little shelf on the left. I do not like that at all. I have my mirror and my tree over there for when I take my full body pictures with, you know, all my clothes and stuff like that. And their toys are just right there. I do wanna switch it up so I'm not completely done with their room, but it is what it is for now. Now for all the moms that deemed me concerned about, you know, having little ones under two with bunk beds, trust me, I was a little concerned, especially with him. He hasn't fell yet, fingers are crossing that he doesn't, but I do have this little mattress here for extra security. These are little decorations that I had on the wall. I made that dream catcher when I was pregnant with Mickey that Flamingo was from the Dollar Tree, the little boys books were from their uncle. I have this little mural painting of the elephant, love it, got it from Ross for like 50 bucks. So over here, I have this little lamb, this lamb was for my mom, she passed away, so this was item that was left behind her perfume over there that I just keep up and away from the boys, eh, like a little protector thing, you know, spiritual stuff. And this tree right here, the fig tree, um, I believe it's seven inches tall. I'll include the information down below. It's about $60. I love these artificial trees. You don't have to worry about keeping them alive or anything. So love that. Like I said, this painting was from Ross. About 40, 50 bucks. Love it. And then I got this little stool storage thing um, from Ross as well. I believe that was like 30 bucks. And then of course, these are like all the boys toys I do want to get another little toy sack thing right there next to the other one and then yeah so this was it so here is our room if you guys are interested in the upcoming video I'm going to give full details on how I redecorated my and Julio's room so I mean honestly decorated because there was nothing on the walls there was no type of furniture or nothing you know so if you guys are interested stay tuned for that if you guys like this video please give me a thumbs up thanks so much for watching and yeah i'll see you guys in the next one